Well, St. Louis police want your help identifying these suspects wanted in connection with Sunday's mass shooting in downtown St. Louis, which left 11 people injured and one teenager dead. Fox News Callista Matrician has the latest on the investigation. You're looking at a bullet hole that remains at the office building here on Washington Avenue, and that is not all. Over to our left, you can see a huge hole in the wall, all the cause of juvenile violence that occurred this weekend. Now police are asking for the city's help in identifying two gunmen. It's one of several we saw on the fifth floor of the office building on Washington Avenue, where a juvenile was killed and 11 others injured on Sunday. The cause of the shooting, police think, could be the suspects, clearly carrying heavy weaponry at the site of the party where many gathered. When you cause a danger to the community and cause that type of harm where you don't have any regard to life, they're going to go out and do that again. It's why Chief Tracy and the city's police department need your help. Lisa Pichota with Crime Stoppers says, If you know something about this, let's get that gun off the street, let's get those people behind bars. Whether you know them or not, you can remain anonymous. We never take your name, we never take your phone number. So far, the department is seeing tips come in. I know a lot of people will step up and some have already stepped up and I thank them for that. We spoke to an individual who works at the office complex on Washington and knows the owners well. The invasion came as a surprise. So the doors automatically lock and the only way you can get in is with a key card or if somebody sneaks around and uh, puts something in the door. He says they just hope people come forward with information. As a stark reminder, they chose to hurt other people. They made the choice to do this. With these suspects out on the street, it could be a matter of time before it happens again. You don't want this to happen in uh, near you. You don't want this to happen again. You don't want some child to die. One juvenile was initially taken into custody and released. While multiple guns were seized in connection, it's time to find those responsible. St. Louis Crime Stoppers tell us they're offering up to $5,000 for any tips that lead to an arrest in this case. In St. Louis, Callista Matrician, Fox 2 News.